What's up everybody? Shooting a little video today for my Humphrey Audio page and my YouTube. Um, it's that time of year again where everybody is shipping guitars. Airplanes, UPS, FedEx, and so on. And so I just get a barrage of questions every day via email or PM or text about shipping guitars. Um, I'm going to run you through some of the myths about it. Uh, first and foremost is that uh, shipping a guitar in tune is bad for it. And that's not true at all. A lot of people that fly with guitars want to know this also. But uh, the people that do it consistently know that uh, keeping your guitar in tune while you ship it or while you fly it doesn't hurt a thing. Except, here's why it's a good idea to loosen your strings while your guitar is in flight. Okay, baggage handlers treat your stuff like crap. Some of them even pride themselves on throwing around musical instruments. And there's not too many ways to mistake a guitar. You see the case, you know what it is. So having that extra pressure on the headstock by having the guitar tuned to pitch uh, could actually aid in the breakage of it if it's mistreated or thrown around. There's about... 16 pounds of pull per string, roughly, it's been said. I've never measured it, but, you know, that seems reasonable. So you have all that pull on that headstock, especially a Gibson headstock like this, and then when it's slammed down, it does that, and those strings help to break that headstock. So that's a good reason to detune them in flight. Your acoustic guitars and your Gibson guitars are susceptible to that. Other than that, you know, Fender style guitars, you know, pretty much bulletproof as far as breaking headstocks. I mean, you'd really have to do something to snap a headstock off of those. But anyway, I just wanted to clear up uh, the myths about uh, shipping your guitars in tune. When manufacturers ship their guitars, they're in tune. Whether they're flying here from Japan or in a container on a ship or whatever, they're in tune. So keep that in mind. You can always keep your guitars in tune when you ship them. But like I said, I recommend that acoustic guitars or electrics or anything with a tilt headstock, I would definitely loosen the strings on that to where they just flop and then tune them up at the other end. Uh, it doesn't take that long for the neck to pull back in pitch. Once you tune it, you'll see it go flat just a little bit, you know, for approximately an hour or so, you know, after you uh, tune it back. But just keep an eye on that and just tune it up and it'll behave for you. So there it is. Good luck.